Hey, back again with new video, guys. This is Sampath Yashang, Sampath Sound Effects YouTube channel, and this is Poco F55 G Custom ROM Reviews. Back with new video. This is Evolution X 9.0. This is not based on iOS, but this is based on Lineage OS, guys. Android version 14, you guys can see. Evolution X version 9.0, 5th May 2024 is the security patch. Vendor security patch. Kernel user is 5.10.209. ZK kernel has been as maintainer. You can check out build date is May 14th. Latest this is 2024. Latest version available for Poco F55 Jata Redmi Note 12 Turbo. These are the apps currently I am using, and this is the typical home screen. What we can get in the edit section. This is how we get in the at a glance. You all get these options here. You can turn on or turn off from here and widgets and other things are given wallpapers and style again lock screen customizations is given and you can customize them and in the wallpapers home screen you will get some principal wallpapers including ai emoji and other minerals wallpapers as we can see on the pixel devices and these are the quick settings toggles let me adjust the brightness here automatic brightness sensor is not going to work in these of the roms and this is the edit section as you can see you will get some options here i haven't faced any issues regarding quick settings toggles just the automatic brightness sensor won't work if i use automatic also it is not gonna work that great and this is the typical app drawer and i haven't faced any issues regarding quick settings as you can see the animations and everything is smooth here coming into some of the apps like dialer we get this kind of dialer here and this is the volume panel and direct video call feature is available and call recording feature is there but it will announce the other person that you are recording a call and camera application definitely it's an hyper camera as you can see but without a Leica integration guys that's how it is for if you want any g cam ports you can use lmc or agc camera how to install that i have made a dedicated video check out in my channel and some of the apps like yeah show me service and this block blast games are pre-installed with this rom we'll see some results guys yeah starting with the geek bench you can see 996 is a single score 3665 is a multi score and 9 lakhs 44051 is a and to benchmark result 9 1.9 degree celsius is the temperature is and four percentage of battery has been dropped and this is the basic entry it is it is profile match but device is not certified here and this is the internet speed test what we can expect from this particular rom and this is with 5g and apart from that drm in false i will show you as you can see level one certified and dolby vision certified nothing to worry regarding that particular settings and all watching ott is also not a problem here using payment applications might make problem because the device is not certification but overall it's great here now coming into the evolver again you get themes and status bar customizations notifications customizations and quick settings power menu actions and lock screen buttons again there are some missings here but you will get this conference spoofing and high fps games in bgmi those options have been included here unlimited google photo storage now into actual settings battery thermal profiles has been given battery usage yeah it's not that good but it's okay battery saver again you get extreme battery saver options are also given scheduling and remembering uh, battery information battery widget again battery diagnostics thermal profiles as i said before sound and vibration again you get all this option do not disturb vibration and haptic feedback strength you can adjust here dolby atmos has been given it will make huge difference guys and regarding display again dark theme you will get that pure black theme and colors options you will get it minimum maximum refresh rate kept to 120 here smooth display option is there tap to wake tap to sleep wake on plug all these things are working fine security and privacy you get both face and fingerprint unlock let me show you the fingerprint unlock first followed by the 
face unlock as you can see both are very much smooth and accurate to unlock your smartphone using that and the accessibility menu which is my personal favorite without actually using the physical buttons you can actually toggle the volume here as you can see now without actually using the physical buttons you can actually toggle them not just that you also get some more handy features you will check out once you flash around now here comes the system and the status bar you get some customizations here very minimal i can say next to uh, pixel is this is kind of like that uh, these all things i don't recommend to flash through this system update use recovery and it's a lineage based case someone who are looking for that kind of rom then you can look out overall it's good rom i haven't faced any issues here it is smooth actually and let's see bgmi and wind up this video coming to graphic settings again you get smooth plus extreme plus i mean the 90 fps options are been given here Gameplay is smooth as of now. Okay. There is no lag even in counter attacks. But again guys, uh, internet connectivity and many more factors involved to get best gameplay output and again remember the processor is don't compare with iphone 15 pro max or latest 8 gen 3 processors it should handle well but don't compare again with high-end devices and gaming experience is always matters on these things performance i mean the processor used the internet connectivity and how the controls you using and what all the graphic settings are set and how is the app optimization sometimes it also depends upon the game only it will be not optimized sometimes with updates it might fix and the gaming experience as of now it's good here yeah that's how the gameplay it was fun enough to play that's how it is guys and i haven't faced any issues here regarding speed test also you guys can check out it's really really good i haven't faced any of the issues as of now and if you're still not joined the whatsapp group for this particular poco f5 5g device you can join the whatsapp group there is a dedicated group for that and it's really smooth guys I haven't faced any of the issues here if you have any specific questions regarding this particular room comment down in the comment section and if you're still not subscribed to my youtube channel hit that subscribe button we'll meet you with another interesting video guys until that keep smiling bye bye for now